Hi guys, now the exciting part is starting. I've finished all the, the K2 two pack painting on the, on the fuselage frame and I finally brought it back to my garage at home from the workshop. So yeah, now it's all to start and fitting it out, which is the most exciting part. I can start getting into my boxes now. I'm packing as I need the different components and uh, but what i think i will do is start off with the undercarriage with the struts and all that and uh, i've gone ahead and done the bushing to make sure they fit nicely for the main gear struts and it's also the cabane struts all ready to go in and i've prepared it what i what i like about the system here yeah, with the bushing is that at the actual bolt the bush twists or turns or other turns inside the round outer bush so what happens here we've got a bigger area for the bush so it actually brings the wear way down because it's a huge area there and when the bolt goes in it actually clamps the bush tight so that the bush doesn't turn around the bolt because the bolt actually between the two lugs, it tightens the bush. So the bush sits there firmly with the bolt, not turning, but the whole outer part of the strut just turns, turns around the bush, which like I say, which is quite cool because uh, it will take much longer to wear. And the other advantage here too is the bolt won't get worn because the bolt sits there holding the bush in place. And uh, so there'll be no wear in the bush I mean in the bolt and uh, you know so you don't have to check it so regularly yeah otherwise just that and then the combined struts got to go in and uh, but what I must will be will do is I'm going to turn the whole fuselage frame just upside down and put the undercarriage up uh, upside down and put the undercarriage and just turn it back on to his wheels yeah exciting stuff uh good I'll uh get on to the next stage and uh, I'll explain to you guys where we are.